Hey everyone, this is Jorgus Game. Welcome back to Dragon Ball Z Budokai. Last time we cleared off all the extra stories in the Saiyan Saga. Now let's find out what's new in... Namek. More of Vegeta's conquest, it seems. Vegeta had managed to make a very narrow escape from Earth. After recuperating in the Rejuvenation Chamber on Planet Frieza, he was ready to make plans for a trip to Namek. His plans are about to change. What do you want from me, Gooey? Well, it seems that Lord Frieza got impatient. He left for the Dragon Balls. Uh, what? I'll kill him! Stop! Frieza! Those Dragon Balls are mine! As a freezer, will listen to you, Vegeta. That was far too easy. You die. Stop! No! Go on. You've got to get out of here. I will protect this Dragon Ball with my life. The hot-headed Prince Vegeta managed to reclaim five of the Dragon Balls and happened onto another. Watch out, Krillin! There's a greedy Saiyan on your tail! <laughs> oh, this is my lucky day! Will Vegeta claim Krillin's Dragon Ball to make an even six? And what new threat is arriving in these spaceships? Vegeta's attack! I see you have a new partner, Vegeta. <laughs> That's freaking soundtrack again. I will defeat you and the little bald one. I just cannot take this one track in it seriously. Huh! Gotta be kidding. With or without him. I will take that Dragon Ball from you. Come on, try it! <laughs> it's your funeral. Sarvan just does not sound interested. That's one thing weird about the voice cast in this game. A lot of it just sounds like they're, they're forcing it themselves to slow down how they're talking. I guess it's to match what they're saying to the Japanese voices, but they could have done a little bit better. It's coming extremely noticeable as, that, as I'm replaying this. Some transformation. We can barely keep it for five seconds. Oh, come on. It's over. I'm just blowing you up now. <laughs> How very careless, Zarbon. Have you forgotten that a Saiyan increases his strength after every battle? I don't care how much your strength increases. No puny Saiyan can match my power. Uh, uh, so, a puny Saiyan, is it? You mock me? Uh, 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 it's like Vegeta had one more thing to say. But the game just cut him off. That amuses me. <laughs> and here you are. Recruit! Better! Die! Ugh, 
asking you! Ah, uh, yes. Well, uh, Not showing the roses this time? Yes, I'm sure Frieza is very glad they're there. So begin, you boys. Who goes first? Well, are you ready for me? Don't worry, because it'll be over very soon, Vegeta. Can you find her? Kum! Well, considering we've only got a couple of the Guinea Force play in this game, yeah, I think I can make it. I don't feel bad about doing any kind of spoilers in this game because there's not much to spoil except for who might be on the roster if you haven't played this before. Take that. Especially with so many future games just having the whole game before us. It was actually several years before we would see that happen. Ha! Not this time. Tricky is right. Vegeta is a cutting son of a bitch. <laughs> That's why it was so interesting to watch here in the Namek Saga. I hear some sort of rumbling. I hope that's not picking up on the mic. I can't really tell if these headphones are on. It's no final flash, but it's close enough. Tell me that was not your best. Come on! I mean, I'm barely warmed up here. Now it's time to die. Oh! Hey, we can use Tudoria, someone who's already dead. Because you skipped on that fight with them. Oh well, got a got corner somewhere. Goku's last minute entry put an end to the Ginyu Force. The elite soldier fell like Domino. And Vegeta Tamaki classes himself in this school of pain. With Vegeta napping, Gohan and Krillin took the Dragon Ball, and with a little aim from the Dende Dende, moves so elegantly. They were able to make their wish. Your wish is granted. How does it sound like more like Chris Sabat, Piccolo's voice? Yes, but how? With Guru's passing, just slightly more groggy. <laughs> and left powerless, crushing Vegeta's dream of becoming a Super Saiyan. Why can't anything good happen to me today? But a Super Saiyan might come in handy when you're. Hey, Vegeta. they're using the dash again. The road to Super Saiyan. Is met with absolute pain. Well, well, well. I must say, Vegeta, this may be a first, but it's far from a pleasure. I have been made a fool of, and I don't like it one little bit. Get used to it. I am well on my way to becoming a Super Saiyan freezer. Hmm. Poor Vegeta. 
big lies. And I had enough of it! <laughs> You can tell he could not keep his composure there. Well, let's go! We've got a nap, let's do this. Wait, let me double check these moves. Yeah, I like Final Bash Meteor, okay. Oh, I almost made the full combo. Ow. And ow. Oh, this I can win easily. You're strong, Frieza, but you're not all that intelligent. Certainly is not much, as much as you would like us to say. <laughs> we are both just trying to use the same strategy. Hey, I was supposed to hit you. So take it. Ow. See, number of hits don't really matter. I mean, that was 15 hits, but I don't feel like 15 hits. First is that five hit combo right there. Oh no you don't. What? That did not finish him? That did. Right in the chest. Well, well. Maybe you weren't lying after all. Impressive. But it's time you learned what real power is. Watch closely, Vegeta. It's rare that I transform anymore. What do you got? Final Bash? This thing I can never use? Faced with Frieza's monstrous transformation. Piccolo decides to merge with a Namek hero, Nail, and combine their powers. I'm here. But Frieza's next transformation proved too much even for Piccolo's new might. <laughs> yeah! That's it! Now I'll truly become a Super Saiyan. My plan really worked! I feel it! I am the Prince of All Saiyan! But no one knows what to call it, Super Josh Saiyan or Super Space Saiyan. Frieza, you would never get you some time to feel mad. You can, You've gotta just kill this them. Time, you face your worst nightmare. I am a super saiyan. In your dreams. Oh, please, you must be joking. I don't know, look what happened at the end of the last episode. He became a Super Saiyan, and he didn't even know what the hell happened. 
<laughs> Makes me think that Vegeta don't even know what a Super Saiyan is. Let's go. Well, at least you're not making him cry. Ow. <laughs> he didn't know what to do. Ah, you got me. Well, not the combo I was trying to end with, but... I can't argue with the resolve. Especially when the uh, tyrant went down that easily. I'm coming for you, Frieza! You can't run for me! Uh, uh, no! <laughs> Are you sure that you're a Super Saiyan Vegeta? I don't know, it seems rather unlikely. What? It's fine, Mini. You are a super dash Saiyan. But there's no legendary Super Saiyan yet. This can't be my limit. But I, I'm a, I'm a Super Saiyan. Ah, I breathe out. Unable to face his greatest failure, the once proud Saiyan Prince loses his will to fight. Well, Super Saiyan, it's time to say goodnight. Friend, what could it be this time? Oh well, he'll be well disposed of soon enough. What? Have to try a little harder of that, Freezer. Freezer, your reign of terror has ended. Now you must face a real, a real Super Saiyan. Now, Vegeta, I told you that I don't like your lies. Vegeta, Freezer, you monster! You didn't have to do that! I don't believe you! He was already down! No, Kakarot! You must feed off your emotions! It's the only way to become... to become a Super Saiyan! Listen to me, Kakarot! Frieza destroyed our planet and all of the Saiyan people! He's very afraid of both of us! And of our possibilities. He knows that you're becoming a Super Saiyan, and you must de defeat him, or, or the proud Saiyan race will end here. C Kakarot, please. And you didn't even need a kidney punch to kill him. Yep, and that what leads us into the actual fight with with uh, Frieza. But we'll see what the raging Frieza is next time. Till then, this is Jargus Gaming. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you then. Take care.